Hey everyone, this is Nitro. So, I just finished S Trial 1, it's time to do S Trial 2. And I'm trying to do as many of these right now because of the new patch that's coming on the 18th. So I want to get all these S Trials done by the 17th, which is tomorrow. That way I can focus on the new patch stuff starting Thursday. In any case, let's begin. So, S Trial 2, the time law, is that Everyone has damage decreased by 20% for each block they move before they attack. So if you move 5 blocks, you're losing 100% <laughs> damage. Okay, so you want to be as close to the enemy as possible when you attack. That's fine. Let's begin. Interesting thing is, chivalry is considered a new turn. So if you chivalry beside the enemy, you'll do 100% damage. Let's take a look at how they're spread out. One archer, one catapult, and the rest are melee characters, which means I want Leaden back in the fight. Which means retreat, because my equipment for Leaden is currently on Ulti Muller. So, jump over to him, quick remove, and let's give Cherry her spear back last night, and annoyingly it also gave her the King's Amulet. So let's finally jump over to Ledin and quick equip. So Ledin has his gear back. Alright, we're ready to run the S trial number two. Let's begin. So let's see how to do this. Well, if Leon uses chivalry and attacks, and then he can move back three tiles like right over there. Then I can use a gain and then, then knock him to sleep and attack him, probably. And then Leaden moves back to protect. Yeah, that's probably the best options. And Sophia will rewind so that Leon can use Chivalry Assault one more time to get rid of the other catapult. And then that would just leave these five melee attackers. Perfect. Alright. Here we go. Chivalry. Because I'm not moving any distance, and they now have 16,000 hit points, I should use Assault. Actually, I don't think Assault even added any damage. <laughs> because I'm attacking right without moving. So I really should replace Assault with another skill, in fact. Uh, it's fine. So I'm going to knock the bat to sleep, because I don't want to take his attack this turn. Clock's activated. Very nice. So... How am I going to get out of range of these guys? Can I even get out of range? I don't think I can even get out of range of the sea monster. Let alone the aquatic general. Yes. So I think Leden is going to end up tanking two hits this turn. Hey. I, I did a mistake here. Bozo should have moved one step closer. Okay. Oh well. So I'm going to have to, I guess, faction buff, a gain, and then divine guard. Let it. I'm taking a lot of attacks this turn with Let it. This is uh, terrible. I massively messed up. I may fail this attempt. Let's see. Regenerate. They are take doing reduced damage, because they are moving multiple tiles, so that may keep my Leaden alive. Oh, it was just two attacks, so Leaden lives. Very nice. Alright. What's next here? 
何をしてるのか分かっているのか Let's continue to put him to sleep for now. 絶望せよ Reduce the number of attacks that I'm going to take. And I want to kill this catapult. This is the big thing. If I can, kill it. So, rewind right now. Well, I may as well attack this bat. Since it's there for me to hit. There we go, some damage there. Medin doesn't have to use any skills right now. He could. I may as well divine guard on him since it's it's available so we'll do that and then Liana will use a gain on Leon and apply sage attack on that there we go all right so now chivalry right beside the enemy so I can do a hundred percent damage to him and hit him Catapult. There we go, another one down. So, let in. We'll have to tank a few attacks this turn. But, since they're moving tiles, they do less damage to me. Which allows let ins to crush them. Alright. Let's have proposal. Fireball this vampire bat now. Perfect. It's nearly dead. And I'm actually going to move back into Divine Guard. Similarly, move back and regenerate. And if I move one tile in attack, it'll do 1.2 times damage at of 80%, which is fine. It's better than nothing. So, yeah, that actually did quite a bit. Perfect. And finally, let's pray her up with Liana. Alright, so, so far, so good. It's... This guy will suicide into lead in. The other guy will suicide to let in too. And I probably retreated a bit too far. I wanted to eat this aquatic general attack, but uh That was a small mistake. Not a big deal. Only two enemies left. I actually want to take both attacks if I can this turn. So let's move up like so. Well. Yeah. Yep, let's do it. Move up. Attack to weaken the enemy. Shift away. Mm. Might as well attack. I guess why not? And then heal up Leon a bit. Okay. Finally, let's put Bozel in an attack position. So, Ledin tanking a 40 damage hit, and Ledin will crush him because Templar versus Demon. And now it's just one enemy left. Which let in will kill with a counter attack. So there we go. Oh! It survived! Surprisingly. Okay. Oh, well, Fireball will finish him off. Done. There we go. So, taking advantage of the time law and using let in to counter attack so he's not moving means. 
this fight was quite easy. Alright, thanks for watching everyone. Nitro out.